You're watching Monty TV. I'm Jackie Karsh, joined now by Joe Lorienti. He is the founder and CEO of Ursa Major Technologies, which designs, builds, and sells rocket engine for a number of applications across the aerospace industry. Joe, thank you so much for sitting down with us. Thanks for having me. Not only are you building rockets, but you want to almost make them available to small companies that aren't necessarily launching them into space like a SpaceX or a Lockheed Martin, but they envision doing so in the future. Where is that industry and how soon is it coming? In order to be a SpaceX where you're designing and building everything in house and your, your money is coming from launching rockets, uh, you need a massive organization, you need thousands of employees. So by selling the most important part of the rocket or what is traditionally the, the barrier to entry, the engines, uh, we're able to reduce our customers' uh, overhead, their headcount, and their time to market. There's uh, an opportunity to reduce the life cycle of a satellite or uh, any space instrument from five, ten years to five, ten weeks if you're launching more frequently. So that's what a lot of these companies are trying to do is increase the cadence of launches and reduce the life cycle of uh, current satellites and, and uh, in space technologies. How powerful are these engines? Because are, yeah. I know what the Falcon 9 is capable yeah. of, lifting the Empire State Building, yeah. but what are your engines capable of? Uh, our engine is 5,000 pounds thrust, so it's... All right, so a little bit more than how much I weigh. <laughs> <laughs> it's about a 20th the size of a SpaceX Merlin engine. Um, so it, it's... Uh, it still makes quite a bit of noise, but it's a small engine comparatively. What does it take to build an engine? We three D print our engines almost entirely. So wait, wait, wait. you three D <laughs> print your engines? Yeah, yeah. Is that safe? It's it's safe enough. <laughs> uh, luckily, we don't have any people sitting on top of our engines just yet, but. Um, it simplifies the manufacturing process dramatically. We only have a handful of vendors that go 3D print these parts as opposed to a really complicated manufacturing process uh, with dozens of vendors. So when someone comes to you, they typically have the rest of the rocket built, they just need an engine to make it go? Exactly. Ideally, we'd get customers that are early enough that they can design their rocket around our engines, but uh, we designed a very versatile engine that will fit most applications in its uh, scale. What we would like to do is develop customers that can go launch on a daily basis or a weekly basis, whatever it is, to enable more access to space. Let's hope the technology blasts off soon enough. Thank you yeah. so much, Joe. Thank you.